Hello Excel Champions, it's William aka Dr. Excel. Today I'm going to show you how to solve Sudoku with uh, with Excel macros. So here for example I have a Sudoku, you know uh, you know the rules, how it works. You have the numbers from 1 to 9 in each square, in each column, in each row, and you have to find um, the correct solution. There's usually only one possible. Uh, so here if I have my Sudoku grid, I'm just going to push solve. Of course, I need a little bit of time to compute everything. And then it's going to tell me that the solution was fine and it's going to give me all the solution. So I'm going to show you how it works. And um, as usual, you'll be able to download the file. It's going to be right below the video. There's a link so you can download it and follow with me. So uh, I'm, I'm going to uh, give you the big picture around this Sudoku solver. I'm not going to go into the code line by line because otherwise it would be complicated. Um, but how are we going to do? What we're going to, to start with is basically to um, start with this grid and say that for each cell, uh, any option is possible. So for this one, we're just going to say in this cell, we have the numbers from 1 to 9 that are still possible. And each time, what we're going to do is uh, each time that we found one cell which has only one option uh, left, then we are going to remove in all the uh, the concerned cells. For example, here we we're going to remove one in all the cells in this row where one is still an option, remove one in all the cells in this column where one is still an option, and same here in this square. So we're going to remove the options and we're going to do so until um, until basically we cannot remove any options, any numbers, um, just by applying the three rules of Sudoku. So at that time, if we, if we just apply again and again the rules, we cannot remove any numbers. So it means that we must take hypothesis. So it means that we must, must make a choice. So for example, in that cell, we could have only two and five remaining. So we're going to say, let's try with two. And that's going to give us a new Sudoku to solve. And, um, and so we're going to start from this one with the two option and try to find an, a solution with the, with two in that cell. If it works, then we're going to have a solution. If it doesn't, then we, then we are going to change to, choose to solve uh, with five and so on. So it removes any hypothesis and it unlocks each time the, um, the new options. So in the, I'm going to show you the code, assign uh, macro edit. So here is the code for the solver. So here you see it's, uh, it's quite a lot of code. So I'm not going to go line by line, but basically what we do is first we transform the Excel grid here into a VBA array. This way we can manipulate it uh, as an object in VBA. Uh, we check if it's impossible, then if it's impossible, we, we say that it is, it is not possible. And otherwise we try to solve it. And so the process is what I told you. Um, so basically we compute the total number of remaining choices that we have, you know, the number of uh, different figures remaining. And we try to decrease this number um, by applying the three rules of Sudoku, uh, columns, rows, and square. Uh, if we can decrease this number, it means that we have improved a little bit. So we go and do loops again and again until we cannot make um, any improvements. And then we make hypotheses, which are here, um, and then make loops for the remaining. Uh, and until we have only one option left for each cell, which is going to give us the solution. So here is one option. I think it's one of the hardest Sudoku that you can find. Uh, I think I have another one here, which is supposed to be quite hard. So I'm just going to copy this, um, paste it. So I'm going to remove the previous grid, uh, paste. I cannot paste what I've done. I'm going to copy this, paste the values here remove the values of the previous Sudoku and just try to solve it. And after a little while, Excel tells me that a solution was found and writes down the solution here. So you see, uh, actually, since it's uh, it's just an algorithm that we, we wrote, I mean, it's, uh, it's kind of easy for Excel to do this very, very fast. 
uh, it does exactly the same uh, the same steps that we would take as doing it uh, manually but it, it's gonna do it very very fast and find the solution automatically so uh, that's one example I wanted to show you to show you the power of VBA that you can do pretty much anything any kind of computations any kind of uh, of complicated stuff but 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 very very fast um, so don't forget to download the file this way you can find the solution for um, uh, for your own Sudoku games uh, so the file is right below the video there's a link so you can access it and download it and I will see you tomorrow for a new Excel tutorial don't forget to subscribe this way you'll be notified when I publish see you tomorrow champions ciao